Welcome back to my channel. It's eight o'clock on Wednesday night and uh, I'm gonna go fill up with LPG. Never done it before. Never touched the auto gas pump at a petrol station. So I thought, might as well bring you along for the ride. Okay, I've come to this shell garage, which is like the closest one to me, that says it sells LPG. I mean, there's even an LPG thing on the uh, the sign over there, by the way. So it says it sells LPG, but I cannot see anywhere. I cannot see an LPG pump anywhere. So let's, uh, let's take a look and see if we can find somewhere else that sells it, I suppose. Typically, my phone's run out of bloody data, so I can't even Google where the next one is. I'm just going to uh, go to another garage and hope that's got LPG. I wonder how many garages we can get to on this drive out before we actually find someone that sells LPG. I thought it was like a common thing, but oh well, we'll find out, shall we? Let's try the BP garage. This is a big garage, it's got to have one. Okay, this is the BP garage, another big garage near me. Oh look, sprint the van life far. Thick boy, there he is, look. You can't see him, see him over there? Sweet. So, big BP garage, do we have any LPG? Hmm. Not on the sign. It's not on the sign. Ugh. Highly annoying. Maybe. Oh, sick. There's the van lifer. There's a the van lifer. You see him? See him going through there? Sprint a friend. Sprint a friend. Sick. We're going to head to the other shell garage now. Well, not the other shell garage. The other, the next nearest garage, and see if we can find some LPG. Just going to be driving around Suffolk at this rate, trying to find someone that sells it. Here we go. Garage number three. Still no LPG. Guess we'll try another shell garage. That's the next one. So I'm getting further and further away from home, but somewhere's got to sell LPG. Sick. R8 just pulled up. It's here. Sick. Look at that. Uh, Double petrol station. Right, another shell garage, shell garage number four, or petrol station number four. Do we have LPG? I've been driving for an hour now. It's not looking good, is it? I've been driving for an hour, it's now nine o'clock, four petrol stations and still no LPG fill up point. I thought it was like common. I'm sure when I get back, we're going to go online and we'll, uh, we'll see if, I'm sure they said that they have LPG. Right, I'm going to go back through town and uh, try a couple more garages and then hope for the best. This is a nightmare, absolute nightmare. We'll carry on, I suppose.
Right, I'm at Morrison's, which has got auto gas on the uh, on the sign there. Now I went to an Asda and a Sainsbury's before I got here. So this is the seventh petrol station I've been to, like in and around Ipswich in Suffolk. And it's now, what time is it? Like half nine at night, so an hour and a half of driving. And I found somewhere that hopefully does auto gas. Look. Do you see? Oh, that was terrible. Auto gas. Oh. Auto gas. No, that's really bad, that's really bad. I'm a little bit nervous. It's gonna fill up. Well, here we go. Have a look at this. Right, instructions. This is handy. Hold nozzle between, hold nozzle behind the gun and guard, blah, blah, blah. Right, we'll have a read through this and uh, <laughs> try and work out how to do this. Um, there she goes, so take my little cap off. Voila. Okay, I'll have to put you down for a second. Oh my God. Right. Okay. Okay. Hold, hold the hose, done that. Pull the lever back until it locks in place, done that. Push button and hold until fill is complete. Push the button, where's the button? Oh, there it is. It's a 23 kilogram tank. I'm so nervous about this. Oh my god, this is making me so nervous. It's filling though. <laughs> it's filling. <laughs> 12 litres. 23 litres I think is a full. I'm waiting for a bang. Waiting for a bang. How do you know it's full? That's liquid, isn't it? So it only becomes, only becomes gas when it... Is that full? Sick! That's full. 10 quid. Right, okay, better read the instructions. To disconnect, hold hose behind the guard and release lever. Do not place hands on the nozzle, okay? Turn lever anti-clockwise, replace nozzle and holder, check display and pay at kiosk. Right, okay. Put you back down. Right, I'm just going to make sure that my level gauge is working. Then we'll go somewhere dry and uh, go somewhere dry and make sure it's not leaking. Ah. Oh, look, it's going up. It's going up. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Oh, good. Full, come on, get to full. Get to full. Get to full. I'm guessing that's it, is it? Yes, full. Full tank of LPG. Well, I better go and pay and then we'll check for leaks. Right, I'm full of diesel and full of LPG. Just while I'm dry and in a, a forecourt, or in a dry forecourt, I'm just gonna check underneath the van and make sure that little bit under the van isn't leaking. And then we'll get home, then we'll run the boiler up and then just make sure the stuff inside the van isn't leaking. So, yep, let's go. All right. Okay, so. On the floor of the van. Oh yeah. 
How would you know if this is leaking or not? How would you know if this is leaking or not? All feels. Well, it's obviously all ice there at the minute. So. Open the valve. Can't hear any leaks. Regulator appears to be okay. Cool, right. Let's turn this off, get home. Run it all up at home. Good. So far, so good. Right, I'm back at home. It's just gone 10 o'clock. That whole ordeal was a, was a two hour round trip. Um, I've got gas because I've got my cooker working. So that's good. I'm not going to run the true McCombie boiler yet because I want to get the operating instructions which are over my mate's house in his shed. And I don't want to go and disturb him this time of night. I've um, got a little issue with my level gauge for some reason. We all saw it working earlier in the, uh, oh, in the garage, but it doesn't want to be filling up unless I suddenly lost a load of gas but I wouldn't have said so because the cooker's on so I need to look at that tomorrow in the daylight but it's cool we we'll are fill up with gas teething problems I can sort out tomorrow before we uh, head off to Scotland so cool thanks for watching as usual subscribe like see you in the next one